Hello there, boils and ghouls. Ooh, it's that time of year again. It's Halloween, and it's where LPs traditionally have to play a very scary game. And, well, this year I have decided to play what is more than likely the scariest game you are ever likely to see me play. I would like you all now to brace yourselves as we launch ourselves into the terror, the horror of what is Long Live the Queen, a 2012 production by Hanoka Games and Spiky Caterpillar. This game was gifted to me a couple of months ago by a friend of mine on Steam, who I haven't spoken to in a little while, so apologies to you first. But uh, here I am, making amends, playing Long Live the Queen for Halloween. But I'm scared. You guys should be too. Now, I have briefly sort of like gone into the game to see what it's all about and stuff and to check if it records and everything, and sadly, it does. Um, apart from that, I don't know a whole lot about it. Um, I don't know whether I'm playing a whole run through, whether we're trying to finish it or what, um, but I think the best way to do this is to do it Iron Man. So, um, I'm not going to, uh, I'm not going to, like, save the game at all at any point. I'm just going to keep going through it, and whatever happens, happens. So, yeah. That's, that's even more scary, you know, to the scariness that we're already seeing right now on the screen, because I'm pretty scared. But yeah. Let's start. Jocelyn King Dowager, Duke of... Calories? Calories? Oh, they're bad. Uh, we've almost home your room... Home? Home? Your room is just the way you left it. Hmm. A load. A loady? A load? That is me, by the way. That is my character, Crown Princess. And we can click here and see that. Like, uh, she's single of 14, as is bloody well what should happen. Um, and our mother, we see, is Queen Nova. Fliddy is, uh, Fid Fiddler, yeah, is, is deceased. And we've got Armand and Laurent, um, who are both uncles. Anyway. I know it's hard to leave your school and all your friends, but I've arranged the best possible tutors for every subject. Oh, good. You'll have to work hard this year to prepare yourself for your 15th birthday. I know you can do it. You'll learn quickly and you'll make a wonderful queen. It's what your mother would have wanted. Wait a minute, if you're king... Why are you making your daughter... Oh my god. See? Scary game! Scary game! Unless there's like some some uh, subplot later where we'll, we'll address this and it turns out that he's like, you know, going to die in 12 months or something because of some plots or some disease or some curse or whatever and so that's when she'll become queen rather than when her father is still king. Yes, daughter. Yes, oh, he's got a brother, Armand, yes, and, and, okay, he's 33, okay. So... So you're 33 and your daughter is 14. Okay. Alright. Not what mother have wanted. She wouldn't have wanted to die and leave me. This is true. Yes, she probably wouldn't want you to have died. That's true, yes. No, she wouldn't, but sometimes bad things happen. You have to pick yourself up and carry on. This is... Ah, oh, this is horrible. This is horrible. Okay. All of Nova depends on us. On you. Oh, I'm playing an angsty teen with pink hair. I'll be here to guide you until your coronation, but the decisions you make are ultimately up to you. Are they? What if I don't want to become queen? What if I don't want to be involved in your sordid, incestuous schemes? Come, your maids are waiting. I have maids are waiting, at least. Uh, well, uh, welcome to Long the Queen. This is your first time playing. You should read this brief introduction of how the game works. Now, okay, let's do this. Ah, uh, tell me more. You'll be controlling Ido Idoli. Idoli? I still don't know. <laughs> I'm just going to call it Idol. Uh, the almost queen of Nova. As she tries to prepare for her coronation. To do this, she needs to take classes every week in order to raise her skills. Skills. The skills she learns will provide different choices on the ongoing plot. Learning the right skills can mean the difference between life and death. 
Now this is where I stopped playing last time because this game featured death. You can die while training to become queen. I, I don't know how. You know, maybe you fall off a horse while playing polo and break your neck or something. I don't know. But anyway, you can actually die in this, in, in this game. So, Iron Man, all the way. We're going to do this. Uh, you can already see what sort of thing, you know. Skills, mood, outfit, classics. Uh, is that, does that say blog? Please don't let like that. I don't want this to say blog. That's horrible. Say, say like diary or something. Don't. I hope that doesn't say blog. You also need to keep an eye on Idol's mood. With her mother's tragic death, Idol is not very happy right now. That's fair enough. The mood button will take uh, uh, take you to the emotion screen for more details. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, here we are. Brilliant. Uh, Idol, Idol, Idol is feeling both afraid and depressed. Um, but her strongest emotion is depressed. She becomes more cheerful to cancel out the depression. Uh, her strongest emotion would then be afraid. I get it. Yes. Well, it wouldn't really, would it? Because if she became more, if cheerful was all the way up here, then surely cheerful would be her highest emotion. And she's willful, feeling willful, and uh, willful pressure yielding and lonely. So we want her to be yielding, obviously. I mean, that's something we need, and we want her to be pressured. Surely pressured isn't a good thing. Pressured or lonely? I mean, that's angry or afraid? Why? Why, why? Okay, so we want this to be about here. Nothing here. Cheerful all the way up here. We want it to be very yielding for the plot. And pressured and look, we want it to feel, uh, well, I don't really know. Neither, I suppose. Anyway. Uh, affects her ability to learn and gives her a bonus to some skills and penalties to others. Let's look at the skill screen. Ah, let's do that. Oh my god! What the hell? I did not expect this! Skills are broken into four main categories. Social, physical, intellectual, and mystical. Inside these categories are skill sets, groups of three related skills. You can start with zero in all skills. Military strategy? It, okay, I didn't... I thought it would be like, you know, charisma, luck, cuteness, and... Uh, Cootsies. I don't know, but no, no, we get bloody, like, expression in instrument and voice and decoration. <laughs> this is a lot more, a lot more in-depth than I expected. Now I'm afraid. Are you afraid? Because I'm afraid. Every week, it all can see two skills. Normally, she earns two points in a skill for every weekday she studies. So if she studies history, she will earn two points times five days for ten points. Ah, okay. Two points, a skill for every weekday. Yeah. Well, be, uh, because Odol is, um, Idol is depressed. <laughs> I can't remember that name because I think I'm pronouncing it wrong. It could be Odo Idoli. El, El, Elodi, Idol, Ed, El, Elodi. I don't Elodi, Elodi. Um, that's a rubbish name, by the way. You could call it Sandra. Or Let's just call her Sandra. It's a better name. Because Sandra is depressed, uh, she has a minus two penalty to the social skill set conversation. No, oh, because she's like, leave me alone, I'm all angsty. Yeah, I hate you, I hate my life. Um, she doesn't feel like talking to people right now. If she sees conversation, she'll earn two, two points, two, two minus two points every day. That is zero points. If she sees conversation, she will earn two minus two points per day. That is zero points. Let's just go. However, she has a plus one bonus in expression skill set. If she sees one of the expression skill sets, she will earn, um, Alright, two plus one points, which is three points a day, fifteen points a day. So there's no point, there's no point studying conversation, because she doesn't want to know it. Uh, fifteen points for the week. Okay, yeah, three points a day. Okay. If you study a skill you have a penalty for, you could be wasting your time and not learning anything. If you study a skill you have bonuses for, you will learn much faster than normal. All these bonuses and penalties will change when Sandra's mood changes. Um, she can also gain bonuses to skills by studying related skills. That makes sense. Check the skill screen every week to see your current bonuses. I can't wait. Once you know your mood, skills, bonuses, and abilities, you are ready to choose your classes for the week. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> the classes screen. Break down skill sets by category uh, for your morning and evening classes. Oh, when you select a skill set, the th three options in that skit will appear on the right side of the screen. 
Choose a class option for both morning and evening classes, then click done button, which will put it in the lower right hand corner. As you play through the story, you'll sometimes see feedback bubbles appearing over text. Uh, these, they tell you what's happening behind this, behind the scenes. Um, oh, there we go. Okay, bubbles like these will show you when uh, Sandra's mood is being altered by events. Bubbles like these, history failed. <gasps> we'll show you when a, a story is changing based on what skills Sandra has learned so far. If the test fails, there is some option being missed because she doesn't have enough skill points in that skill yet. Oh, well, replay value, everybody. This feedback is very helpful in figuring out what different options to try. But if you don't want to see it, you can turn the bubbles off in the preferences menu. I'll leave them on. Now get ready to become a queen! Oh, I can't wait to be a queen. Wait a minute. Just go. So. Hello, me. So I, I guess her facial expression will change as we go through the game. So, there's our skills. So let's pick our classes. That's what we're going to do. And I think we should go into... Expression... Oh, wait a minute. Plus options. Court manners, flattery. Um, skills. Where is it? Could be by um, okay. outfit. I don't care about that. Log. Well, not blog. Log. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Royal demeanor. So I can pose your elegance, presence, or a confidence in command. Oh, this is ridiculous. Uh, I think we should start her off with like a military history, <laughs> Novian history, or something like that. Foreign affairs. Now let's start her off gently. Uh, oh, and oh, there. Go play with some dogs first of all. Role playing, and we can, and then, and then in the afternoon, we'll have a study some compote. She needs to be to bear pain. Uh, uh, composure. Okay, let's do that. Okay, done. Okay, so week one, morning. We visit the kennels and learn about different breeds of dogs. Marvelous. I'm still depressed. Come on, the doggies. Play with the doggies. Um. Noon, you are too depressed to focus properly on the subject right now. I thought that might be the case. Oh dear. Um, what's the noise aside? Who's there? Oh, it's my cousins! My aunt and uncle! Oh yes! Darling, darling, we are terribly sorry to hear about your mother. Uh, thank you. You look well, niece. Hi, Lodi! Hi, Lottie! Oh god, I haven't seen you in ages. Will you be staying long? Yep! Mummy said we'll be here all month. Who the hell are you, Charlotte? Ah, uh, god, I'm gonna have to start bloody um, thir third in line to the throne. Oh, she's so what? Look at those eyes! She's evil! She'll want to kill me and take. Yes, that's right, she's the evil um, person who's poisoning my father, so he'll die in 12 months. And then. Um, and, and then, then she'll kill me at me, and then, boom, sorted. Okay. Um, here all month. Maybe we'll have some time. Oh yeah, beautiful. Yeah, time to sort later. Oh, oh god, a map. Now if you're studying, what will you do for the weekend? Party. Uh, talk to your father. Attend court. Plus one depressed. Now, okay. Explore the castle. Plus one lonely and plus one afraid. Oh come on. Uh, attend service plus one. Why do I want to do that? Uh, visit tomb, depressed and afraid. <laughs> oh, well, I should get... Oh, what can the end? Lonely and cheerful. She'll probably do that, I'm thinking. Sneak out. Ooh. Uh, play with toys, yielding lonely and cheerful. Uh, visit shell. You know what? I think we should either take a walk in the garden or... Um, so we can either have plus one cheerful or... Well, this one gives plus one yielding as well, and that one just gives the same thing. So we'll play with our toys. Dolls! Yay! You spend your weekend hold up alone in the room with your favourite toys. It's childish, but you feel a bit better. I get. Okay, right. Fantastic. Uh, now I'm gonna pick skill again. The classes again. Oh no, wait. We can look at skills. And has anything increased? Um, composure has increased slightly. Um, but we still have. Oh, there's a minus one. There's minus one. Minus one for military. Although animal handling has increased. Yeah, she's a bit better with dogs now, which is cool. Um, so let's. So we can. We we're sitting around a dance class or something. And then maybe archery. I tell you what, let's be a let's be a warrior queen, actually. Uh, yeah, so weapons. We're in athletics. Uh, agility. Okay. Uh, send her on a dance class and we'll have some bloody archery lessons. <laughs> I should make her feel better. Get her, you know, a bit active here. Get her mind off her mother's death and stuff. That's what we'll do. Um, okay, here we go. Week two. So I guess there's 56 weeks. Oh good, alright, you practice cutscene standing and walking across the floor in a grateful manner. That's not really what I had in mind for dancing, but, you know, never mind. 
And afternoon, you are too afraid to focus properly on this subject. Oh, but it did increase a little bit. Okay. Uh, what's, what's outside? Father, what's going on? I have come to pay my respects in honor of Mother. Oh, hello, Juliana. She doesn't look very happy, does she? You have no respect or honor. It's because of you, your, your powers, uh, and your powers that my wife is dead. Oh, okay. What? I am a Lumen, as was she. Uh, um, like many Lumen, I am willing to give my life to this subject out of me. Who the hell? Oh, you're 34 and single. Um, and a father is dead. And you're a Lumen. So I guess we're of Nova and you are of Lumen. Your line has been traitorous for 200 years. I won't have you corrupting my daughter. No, you've got time for that yourself, haven't you? Uh, now it's for the Crown Princess to decide. Oh, uh, your mother trusted me. I have much to teach you. Arrest her! Send her to the dungeons forever! Let's arrest her. You are a traitor to the crown! I ought to have you executed! Guards, arrest her! Throw her in the castle dungeons! <laughs> and let her rot! Well, I suppose she won't be a problem anymore. He's like, whoa. Okay. Ah, what should we finish anyway? What should we do for the weekend? Maybe that's what again. Well, I think we should do something else. Visit Charlotte's? Visit the dungeons? Explore the castle? Visit the tomb? Attend court? Don't want to be more depressed. Talk to our father. Should we chat to him? Let's have a chat with our father. Dad, what really happened to Mum? Uh, she was a Lumen, a magic user. Oh, thank you, a magic user. Um, it was meant to be in reserve to defend our domain, but she insisted on... You need to hear that. She used magic, she drained her strength. Uh, I thought it was harmless. She thought it was harmless, it wasn't eventually. Her heart just stopped. That's why I don't want you involved in it. Ah, well, you'd probably be blind, glad that I sent that woman to the dungeons. Um... Alright, classes. Um, oh, and skills. We've got skills. We've got skills. We've got a little wine dance there. Dogs. Uh, composure. But yeah, we don't need to. Um, maybe we should study intellectual stuff. Um, not athletics. She's too too scared. Although a weapons thing is actually gone now. Although we do get a bonus in expression. So let's actually be expressive. I'm going to our classes. We're going to expression and... Uh, drawing, paint, yes, yeah, paint some pictures, and then we can do something a little more like magical history. Oh, well, maybe she'll be interested in that now. Meditation. I'll tell you what, we'll meditate for a little bit. So we'll we'll decorate, we'll paint, and then we'll meditate. So we'll have like a a, a week of intellect and uh, reflection. That's what we'll do. That's what I've decided. Uh, week three. We discussed the nature of beauty, looking around at landscapes, objects, and people, and comparing their aesthetics elements. And she seems to increase. Uh, yeah, the bonus because she's depressed, and all, all artists are depressed, aren't they? So yes. And uh, afternoon, you practice assuming a sitting position that allows you to be uh, relaxed and tranquil without being so relaxed that you're likely to fall asleep. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Increase by ten. Shawl. He loves me. He loves me not. Do you have a boyfriend? Not really, I just like to play with the flowers. That's a face of evilness. You, Charlotte, are um, are evil. You are the villainess, I've decided, and I will take it upon myself, this playthrough, to have you executed. Me too. Gather your skirts and pads it down. All of a sudden, a hissing noise alerts A snake! A snake! Badges, 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 badges. Don't move! You got for a stick. Oh, goodness. Um... Okay, so reflexes failed. But push the snake away, but you lack the skills to do the properly poking the snake only makes it angry too fast. It lunges towards and six is funny to your leg! We're dead. Ow! The snake is away, but it's too late now. A strange tingling sensation begins to spread through your flesh. Yeah, we're gonna die in week three. It's a milk vapor. They're poisonous. I don't feel good. Uh, you like he's going numb, you stumble and fall to the ground. Seventeen weeks later, we have missed half of the game and we wake up. Uh, in a fever. Hold on! Cousin kneels beside you and presses her hands over the bite mark. The area throbs painfully, then begins to. Wa oh, you're. <gasps> Evil! She must be killed! Um, after a minute, you're dizzy, your leg isn't buzzing anymore, and even the wound disappeared. Oh, well, maybe. Hmm. How do you do that? I don't know. I just do it. I just can't. Okay, so maybe, maybe my idea about her being the evil, wicked witch of the West might be wrong. With her saving my life and all in the third week. <laughs> Although maybe, maybe she planted the snake there in order for it to bite me. And then she knew how to heal it so she can gain my trust. So I will let my guard down. So she can kill me later. 
That's what it is. I'm not supposed to tell anyone. People think it's freaky. You won't tell, will you? Of course not. Oh, wait a minute. I want to. I want to have a set to the dungeons for saving my life. It's just lucky you were here. Yes. Girls, what's going on here? I heard yelling. We were just playing. Nothing. We just saw a snake. We got away. Oh, come on. You little snitch. The one was like, nothing. Um, a snake? That's it. Shall I pick up your things? We're going back to Merva. It's not safe here. Oh. That's ruined your plan, hasn't it? Uh, oh, well, that should make me a little more depressed, shouldn't it? So I'm going to walk in the garden and feel lonely, I guess, maybe. I don't want to visit the dungeons. I could sneak out, but... Everything makes me feel bloody lonely. Um, yeah, let's go to the gardens. Walk in the fresh air helps you forget the burdens on your shoulders. Great. Oh, here we go again. So, let's have a look. So, uh, we like expressing ourselves, don't we? And uh, maybe we should do something in... Intrigue. Oh, no, it's minus. Is that minus one? Oh, yeah, plus. Okay, no. So, expression, um... Mm. No, physical. We'll do our reflexes now. <laughs> we'll think, oh, anyway, I was going to go by a snake. I should be a bit quicker. So, reflex. Although, we've had a reflex test now, so it's unlikely the game will throw another one at us. So, let's do another flexibility. Yeah, okay. We'll do flexibility. And we'll do uh, more divination. Uh, our meditation. Um, um, yeah, maybe... I'll do some more meditation, actually. We'll get our meditation bill. So meditation and, um, where was it? Flexibility. Hello. Yeah, okay. Um, I've decided. We, uh, but I've forgotten. <laughs> no, it wasn't there. Where the hell was it? I'm getting there. Hang on. There. Flexibility. And, uh, we'll do some meditation more. Okay. Good. Okay. So. Uh, week four, you learn to relax and evaluate attention in your body, then practice different types of motion available to, to, uh, to each of your joints. Twisting, sh shifting, and rotating. And we get a bonus because we're afraid. Yeah, that makes sense. And uh, close your eyes and relax every muscle in your body internally. In that uh, feeling travel down to you from your head to your fingertips and toes. So we're very good at meditating now. Great. Uh, the castle seems quieter that with Charlotte and Emery and Zara and their parents gone. Everybody's left us, which is me and my dad here. Which is scary! You don't want that. Certainly not empty, though. It seems that we get more servants every day. Oh, okay, that's better. Uh, what do we want to do? Should we sneak out? We haven't sneaked out. Let's sneak out. Let's do that. You sneak out of the castle and have a little fun. You enjoy your freedom, but your father wouldn't like it if he found out. Plus, you know, we could also be assassinated by, by the Dark Brotherhood and stuff coming to kill us. I imagine that could happen. Okay, here we go. So she's still bloody depressed. Let's look at our mood and see. Okay. A little less depressed now. More willful. So we're getting towards the, you know, middle here quite a bit, which is good. Which is good. Although I'm pretty sure... How do I get off this? I suppose I'll just go into skills. Um, so should we... Oh, let's do one of these. Let's do one of these. Let's do flattery. Let's do flattery and... In fact, why don't we do flattery and, and, and just stick with... Oh, maybe... Um... I'm just having to think here. I'm just having to think. This is, this is more than I expected. <laughs> more in depth than what I thought it would be. But I think we should do maybe maybe two lots of conversation. So do public speaking and, and flattery. Probably not the most exciting week in the world, but hey. Um, outfit. Okay. Why are we at boarding school? Boarding school uniform. That seems a bit harsh. Anyway, glasses. Um, public speaking. And, and we're going to do flattery as well. Flattery. We'll flatter some people. Okay, so week five, you practice tongue twisting se uh, sequences of syllables to improve your enunciation, which I could do with. And uh, you learn that it's important to make eye contact when saying nice things about someone. Yeah, rather than to be all shifty and shuffling your feet and stuff. And now, oh, one of the maids approaches for your attention. My lady, curries have arrived from the Duke of Sedna. Send them away! Um, oh, no foreign language, no foreign affairs. We have a Duke of Sedna? Uh, no, lady. The, the Duchy of Sedna is in Tal- Of course it is, stupid me. Is there a world map? You know, because this seems quite- Hello, Alice, by the way. Uh, you're 18 and single. Owns a bakery in town, has two brothers. Why would I even know that? I don't care, I'm gonna be queen. I don't really care about the brothers and stuff. They have brought you a letter and a gift. Condolences to the death of deep regret. Best wishes. Oh, what a beautiful necklace! Woo! Simply, oh, court man has failed. <laughs> Some sparkling would make me feel better. Oh, I'm failing everything. Uh, should we play our toys? Um, ten service. Uh, should we go to the dungeons? Ah, let's explore the castle. Wander through the parts of the castle 
uh, where other people rarely visit, uh, but find little except spider webs. Yuck. Has that been added? If I go into my outfit, can I? Oh, I thought I had a sparkly necklace I could put on. Gutted. Um, okay, so all the skills that we've currently learned, we have used none of. I don't think we should do meditation anymore. She didn't have much of a bonus in that, no, anyway, because she's probably bored of it. Um, although, yeah, we should do court manners now. Definitely court manners. And how about a little bit of horses? Okay, we'll do that. Uh, so, um, court manners. And go for riding a horsey. Okay. Week six, review the correct meetings for guests ordering uh, according to rank and then extend your hand to another. All nobles expect you one. Okay. That's good. And you walk around the stables meeting the royal horses, learning about their breeds and names in different parts of their anatomy. Legs, eyes, head. How difficult could it be? Um, that woman, the priestess, keeps staring at me. Ah, send it to the dungeons! What do you want? Your destiny will find you even if you run from it. You are born to wield the power of Lumen. Oh, really? You're another one of those, are you? Um, Sacred Ghost takes part in religious services and Sandra's tutoring in faith. Oh. Okay. What do you know about that? Power was your mother's uh, and the kings and queens before her. It is your right and your responsibility to defend your domain. I have seen signs of the future. Danger is coming. Without that power, this land is defenseless. Oh, it's going to be a battle. It's going to be a war. What am I supposed to do about that? I'm 14, for God's sakes. The Duchess of Ursul will teach you if you set her free. Oh. <laughs> but she never harmed your mother. They were friends. It is only because she bears the power of Lumen so openly that your father rejects her. I want to send you to the dungeon. <laughs> well, she's been in prison for about six weeks now. Uh, do you think she'll really... Um now, do you really think that she'll, like, be willing? Oh, I totally forgive you for that. <laughs> That's not around anyway, it'll be fun. I'll free her. Very well, see if she's released, so I'm more willful. When she's free, speak to her and she will guide you. Yeah, if she doesn't stab me in the half, <laughs> locking her up for a month and a half. Uh, maybe we should visit the dungeons. Oh, they're willful and angry. We can do that now. Explore the castle, visit the tomb. Um, uh, or visit Juliana. Uh, ten court. No, let's do ten court. Let's do that. Sitting in court sessions is not fun at all, but it pleases your father and may be important to your future. Yeah, that's good. Let's be... Okay, so yeah, a slightly different expression now because we are now a little bit more willful, more lonely, less depressed, more afraid. Okay, so let's go into our skills and see what we can do now. Uh, so we get bonuses in... Let's, let's learn. Let's, let's do voice, actually. Let's do that. Let's do voice. Um... And the bonus is to agility face, probably to everything. And we can... Maybe if we studied some history or something. Let's study some... Accounting. Okay, so we'll do voice and accounting. That's what we'll do. Do voice and accounting. Uh, voice and... Uh, accounting. That's what we'll do. So accounting's really boring, but you should be able to, you know, have a bit of a sing and stuff. So, week seven. You practice deep breathing exercises to build up your ability to sustain a note. And in the afternoon, you brush up on basic mathematics in the help of uh, an abacus. Okay, so, yeah, okay, that's fair enough. That'll help. You're walking up the stairs, a maid comes rushing down, holding a, a towering pile of limbing. This is another thing I'm going to really fail. Before you can react, test failed, failed. She barrels into you, sending you in the sheets flying. I'm going to break my neck and die, aren't I? Oh, I'm so sorry. It's bloody you again, isn't it? It's that 18-year-old with the bloody two brothers in the bakery. Punish you! I'll punish you! How dare you! What do you think you're doing? Have you flogged for this? Yes, my lady. <laughs> I wonder what these are. They're going to be unlocked later, obviously. Visit the dungeon has no effect. Um, let's, let's visit Juliana. What do you want to teach me? First thing you do, you have your mother's crystal. Oh, so she completely forgives me. Completely forgives me for locking her up for six weeks. Um, need to know if you have your mother's crystal. What crystal? I don't have the crystal. The source of the power for Enelum is a particular magic crystal. Once you've bonded with it, it becomes part of you as long as you live. The royal crystal has been passed down from ruler to ruler for generations. It belongs to you now, except that the king may be keeping it from you. <gasps> Do you have the crystal? Of course. She holds out her hands like crystal flickers above her bosom. And then, with a shower of sparkles, sparkles, something takes shape. You reach out to touch it, it dissolves away into nothing. Oh. 
It belongs to me. No one can take it from me until I die. Really? Hmm, well. That could be uh, arranged. You need to find the crystal that belongs to you. But surely it was my mother's crystal. And now look at this face. Not happy. Um, alright, so. Um, oh, we get a bonus of medicines. Let's, let's do some poison medicine. Let's do that. And I think... Maybe do falcons as well. A bit of falcons in there. So medicine and falcons this week. So animal handling falcons and then boring medicine lesson lessons. Okay. There we go. So week eight, you visit the muse and learn about different types of animal of trinal birds. They uh, prefer nesting sites, behavior, and food. The first treatment for most ingested poisons is to purge the stomach by forcing the victim to eat powdered charcoal, which can resolve the dangerous substances. Okay. Good to know. So there we go. Uh, there's a man to see you. He wishes uh, crown funding for a project of his. Remember, the treasury is not unlimited. If you choose to invest... You're still the bloody king, by the way. I am training. This surely is your job. If you choose to invest, you will have us, uh, less money to work with later, obviously. A man. Hmm. Just a man. An invisible man. Your Royal Highness, I have a plan to print books using metal letters which can be moved uh, and reused. I need to borrow 100, 875 lassie to assemble the metal and factory to mold the cast and type. With this system, I'll be able to create new books with a fraction of the time it takes now and make copies to send all over the world. Don't know much about factories or trade? No, of course not. Would it really worthwhile? We're not interested. Oh, thank God's sakes. Yes, silly! That worked really well in the real world. Oh. oh well. I'm gonna play my bloody toys. That's what I'm gonna do. I should have spoken to my dad about this crystal. Oh well. Um, yeah, I feel a bit better. Obviously, I feel a bit. I feel. I look bloody ill. Is what I do. Um. Okay, so we get a bonus in here again. So let's do uh, more herbs, and we can also maybe learn an instrument or something. Although no, public. Oh, we get a bonus to public. Uh, public speaking, we'll do public speaking, cop manners, flattery, cop manners, cop manners, we'll do cop manners, and we'll do battlefield herbs, battlefield medicine, that's what we'll do. Yeah, so, um, um, so where was that? <laughs> uh, public speaking, no, cop manners, cop manners, and, like I say, and medicine, no, battlefield medicine, okay, done. So, week eight, uh, sorry, yeah, week nine, um, as a person with highest rank in the main, no one was okay. We we uh, we know that we know that. Um, or maybe maybe I don't. We already know that before. It's crossed by seventeen. So yes, as a person with highest rank within the domain, no one may sit at any formal event unless you give them permission, and no one must ever turn their back on you. If they do, you are intended to recognise the insults. Your know, city rules and formal dining, um, including the proper utensils of different dishes. Oh good, now I know how to bloody eat. As the queen, no one will. Uh, come out of your mistakes, but they will notice them. Now I know how to eat. That's fantastic. You learn that wounds, even minor ones, should be washed as soon as possible to prevent dirt going under the skin. Alright then. Uh, hello, Banyan. Um, your Highness, my, my sympathies for your loss. Oh, come on. It was pretty ages ago now. It was two months. I'm, I'm totally over it. Um, even after these years, I sometimes forget that my own mother will never be coming back. 31. Single. Right. Thank you. However, I must call for your aid. The Iloxite occupation of the country from Imbran has gone on for too long. Now is the time for I think this is more like my dad's thing. You should really talk to my dad about this. He is king, after all. Oh dear, failed. I don't know anything about the man. I don't want to fight. Oh, bloody hell. There must be a peaceful way to settle this. I will send the diplomats to try and come to some arrangement. I'm a bloody useless queen, but then again, I'm not queen. I'm 14 years old. Um. So if you ask the necklace you're wearing, where did it come from? Oh, I got it from a gift from Duke Sedna. Can you have made arrangements with him? Uh, if I'm engaged to the Duke. There you go! Success! Uh, how old was he again? It should be considered. Well, I suppose it depends what era this is set in, obviously. It's in the older world, sort of like, you know, medieval type, and, you know. It's not unusual for people to be married at, or, you know, considering what you should be sort of marrying at 14, I suppose, but I wouldn't be considerate. I'm a, I, I just like jewellery. Not at all. <laughs> but I appreciate the presents, doesn't everybody? Hint, hint. 
If you say so, your hands. Okay, now that I've been studying, I can go and see my king about the bloody crystal. What happened to Mum's crystal? It's in the safe place. Can I have it? No. <laughs> but it's mine! Meddling with magic killed your mother. I don't want it to happen to you. Once you're crowned queen, I can't stop you from doing anything you want, but for now you're still a child. Yes, obviously, even though I'm sending diplomats all over the place and... Yeah. Double standards much. Okay, my mood... I'm quite... I guess I'm quite lonely. I need to feel more pressured. Okay, let's try and feel more pressured. Uh, oh no, wait, wait, skills. Um, okay, we're getting like a few different bonuses now, so I might study reflexes or... Uh, study dance. I guess it's a dance. And um, study dance and study some more public speaking. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Start, start doing that, so public speaking. And, um, and dance. Done. So, now, week 10. Um, to do business and practice speaking loudly and clearly, you're projecting your voice to every corner of the room. You memorize lists and sonnets to recite them for your teacher as any uh, castle staff she can round up to serve as an audience. Okay, so that's good. And in the afternoon, we learned uh, practice walking on the arm of a partner and following their cues to pause and turn while keeping your eyes closed. Why do you have to keep your eyes closed? Oh, I suppose that's just for practice. Fine. A representative from uh, Iz Izion is here. Be careful, no one wants to give up prizes that they have won. Okay, you have full support of my sister and myself, your highness. Great. Hmm, <laughs> let's get it over with. Oh. Okay. Uh, failed, of course. Uh, thank you for granting me this audience. I'm sure we can come to an amicable agreement. Yes, of course you don't have a face. By bygones? No. Uh, we will forget about your unprovoked. We will forget about your unprovoked actions on us, and you will transfer the rights to this little province. Failed. <laughs> You'll, uh, we can be good neighbors again without lives being lost. Execute him. I love that. <laughs> Bribe them. Bluff or intimidate? I'm a, I'm a 14 year old girl. Let's give that one a go. You are trespassing on our land. You will withdraw your chips at once. Only then we will have peace. Yes! Ah! Oh, where might we convince him that we're already allied? Would you send it in the nice one? Threaten to attack. Nah, no, claim we're allied. As you see, we're already allies. You really want to face both Nova and Talase? Perhaps not. Yes! Alright, a good job. Oh, come on, yeah. Booyah. Um, so I need to feel more pressure, don't I? So uh, let's... Let's attend court. Oh, that makes me a lot more yielding. Oh, everything makes me believe more yielding. It's the only thing that makes me more pressured. So I... I um, this is your father, that's good. Still not very happy at all. But a little more towards the middle. Um, so that's, that's fantastic. Okay, so... Um, I can, yeah, I like this, I like this. Um, maybe we should start playing instrument or something, or express ourselves through some more voice. Although we get massive bonuses here, and here. So, <laughs> so let's study herbs and study flattery. Okay. So, herbs. Uh, wait a minute. There, so. Flattery, and let's study herbs. Or herbs, as it's also known, because it's got that little letter there. That one there. That that that's a H for herbs. So, uh, flattering comments um, have the best impact when kept short. Gush gushing makes people uh, feel awkward. Oh, I simply love that. It's marvelous. I really. When did you get it? I would like one. Please tell me where you got. Yes, okay. Uh, you learn that it's sometimes always better. That it's always better to compliment people. For their personality and their choices rather than their physical attributes. So you can't say, hey, nice ass. Doesn't work. You have lost a new outfit. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be wearing that. Uh, you learned that willow bark can be used to, rel to relieve aches and fever. That's good to know. There are reports of a key th that a key thong has been cited leaving the old forest. What the hell is a key thong? Is that a monster or something? What's a key thong? Oh, law failed. 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 A beast with the body of enormous golden cat, a sharp beak, and spikes on the- Oh, it sounds cute. Eek! Several disappearances in, in, in southern calories are already thought to be the work of this creature. What do we do? Do we just send hunters? The traditional policy on stray beasts is to hope that they return to the forest and stay there. Hunters are no match for such creatures. You would only make it angry and waste more lives. So we just let it eat people? 
Everyone dies in the end. Oh, that's so... That's fantastic. What a brilliant king we have. He's like, yeah, it's eating people, but, you know, they're gonna die anyway, so what's... Uh, it's okay. Also, there's a letter for you. Uh, right next week to a visit. visit. Okay, marvellous. Brilliant. Can't wait. Oh, we can judge our mood. Uh, that's quite handy, actually. Um, so, um, so what do we actually want? I feel a bit more pressured. What if we go to court again? It's plus two yielding, so it gets us all the way... Where's yielding? Oh, it's, so it's down here, so I'll be less willful. Um, lonely and cheerful. I could village you. I could village you. Okay, it won't give me, it won't give me my, it won't give the crystal. I'm going to just have to wait. No, it may not be time to wait. The world is filled with dangers, and you will need the powers of Lumen to fight them. You can't begin training until you've had bonded with, until you've bonded with your crystal. Well, what else is I supposed to do about it? The crystal is probably held under guard at the royal treasury. You are the princess. You should be able to find a way inside. Well, I walk in, because it is the royal treasury, and I am training to be queen. It still worries me, but I'll carry on with this. Otherwise, we might have to take drastic action. What drastic action? No, I'll find a way in. It's fine. Now we'll get into the treasury. So willful isn't really... Yeah, willful is more like... Um... Yeah, obviously. I was thinking uh, Willful's more like... Oh, it's a matter. Don't know what I think about the time. It's fine. Uh, so this is all nice. This is good. I kind of want to keep going with the same stuff that I'm learning. So we can do perhaps some more public speaking. We can even do like public speaking in court manners, but I kind of want to vary it a little bit. Um, maybe some foreign affairs. I don't know. Yeah, let's let's actually do history of the world because we don't we haven't had a test on that yet and it's probably going to come up. So we'll do some more public uh, court manners and then we'll do world. That's what we'll do. Oh, a new outfit, new bloody outfit. Okay, so what does that boost? I don't know. We'll bloody wear it. Boost conversation. Oh, that helps. Oh, so now if we go to our skills. Composition uh, has increased a little bit more. Excellent. Well, well, well oh, no, I forgot what I was going to do. Um, yeah, let's do let's do court manners and let's do no, let's do herbs. Let's do herbs. Decided we do herbs. So um, yeah, more herbs and uh, public speaking. No, court manners. There, done. Okay. So you study a tradition uh, of ball yeah, about how to politely accept someone and undertake an offer and how to avoid the impression you have attachment to an individual. You memorize correct title for every servant in the castle. Treating servants with respect ensures good service. Oh, I had someone flogged earlier. Oh dear. Um, you learn that fever few can be used to reduce tension and headaches. You learn a while of clothes from the skin can relieve pain, particularly in teeth. Great. And someone's visiting. Hello. Ah, oh, your highness. What pleasure is it, um... What a pleasure it is to meet you in person at last. Your description did not do you justice. Oh, you're creepy, and you're 26. It's kind of creepy, man. You have silver... Ah, oh, so, oh, there we go. Flattery. An eye for unfinished potential. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, although I look very pretty in my new hat, so kind of nice. Both admirable qualities. I'm so pleased to hear that you had accepted my humble offering. A duel for a duel, but you are the most precious... Oh, you... Ah, oh, it's so... Ah, it's just the grease just slide, just sliding all off you. It's horrible. I hope there's the, uh, uh, this is the beginning of mutually beneficial friendship. The union between us would bring stability to both our peoples. He really does want to marry me. She's at least surprised and not happy. It's a bit sudden, isn't it? You know, I'm not even queen yet, and you're like asking to. Oh yeah, fine, I'll marry you. No wait. Maybe I won't. I'll decline. Yeah. Hard to get. Need to let him down gently. Yo, Grace, how are you in the house? Yeah, it's caught, manners. Uh, but I regret that uh, my uh, impulsive enthusiasm may have misled you. Such a decision would not be made in haste. I would, of course, look blind to suit in the future. I love that. Has any impression of the decision already been made, Your Highness? Was it not what I told you? Was that not what you told the representatives from Izion? Uh... Well, maybe it was. But that doesn't mean I meant it. <clears throat> oh. Oh, that. As in my king, who was not pleased to discover promises apparently made on his behalf. 
Um. Okay, fine. I'll marry you. My mistake as you care and the consequences. Oh, okay, now, okay, great. Now, now I'm a 14 year old who's bloody married, which will of course probably upset my father for the way that the plot was going. But anyway, hope you will not say I managed with me to be t a punishment. You're 26, so I mean, like, you're only three years younger than my dad. No, 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 you're six younger than my dad. My dad's pretty young anyway. Um, no one in this game is above 35, I think. Um, the Grace, given her youth, Julie will allow some time for a betrothal period? Of course, we never pressed that badge on a child. Exactly, thank you very much! Um, you have much to do. Uh, with your courage to prepare for. I might be of service in any way, please send for me. I will happy to offer my protection over. Okay, so at least we've got an ally. So when we go to when we when 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 we upset someone, we'll have somebody on our side. Sedna. Okay. Thank you. Bye. So now I'm gonna be bloody married. I'm gonna attend a service. Uh <laughs> Okay, because we need to do that after I don't know, I just did that. Just did that, just happened. So Hello. Uh so we're very good at court manners, which has really helped us so far. Um, and I think we should probably go into, yeah, world history or something now. Start learning stuff like that. Cause we, well, maybe we should go into accounting again. Or trade and production. All this sort of stuff. I don't know. I feel like I should be concentrating on some rather than mixing it up and failing every bloody test because I only have 10 points in it, if you see what I mean. So, I do like, yeah, let's go into flattery, I think. Flattery, and then we'll go into, we'll do a bit more accounting, I suppose. Okay, we'll do that. So, let's do flattering, and then we'll do accounting. Okay. So, uh, visual elements are best to flatter on, uh, on first meeting. They are expected to be noticed straight away. If you spend more time with someone, suddenly, suddenly confident on their attire will ring false. Right, okay. Small personal details help make up the recipient, uh, the recipient of your flattery feel that you've truly noticed them, which is always better than how nice you look. Um, we study the manipulation of larger quantities through a direct calculations using written numbers instead of an abacus. You are requested to stand in judgment. A woman has been convicted of an attempt of murder and requests the mercy of kill her, flog her, send her to the prison here. Uh, Your Highness. This slattern dares to beg pardon. Uh, when she admits she tried to poison my sister under her own roof. Who the hell are you? You got a lot of family. Uh, again, 33. The, uh, the Earl of Lowe. Several younger half-siblings. Which sister? Uh, that one. <laughs> she alright? Uh, she isn't harmed. We caught the culprit in the kitchens before anyone... I really need to study that bloody history because it's happening all the time. Uh, we caught the culprit in the kitchen before anyone could eat a foul sp uh, spew. Well, what did you have to say for yourself? It's just as it is. The devil's killed me brother and brought me mam's heart. Lied to her they did when she went to see why he'd not come back. Said he'd gone for a soldier when he never would. She yeah, okay. We weren't only one neither. I waited ten years for me chance to get me home back. That's justice that is he by gum. You see, she's completely unrepentant. Anger, I'm hanging around with it. I don't know what it's all about, of course I don't. Either way, murder is a serious crime, but... Hmm, we can put it to work. Yeah. No one failed in the goals, not... She harmed no one, I do not require a life. Well, that's kind of... Yeah, an attempted murder. You don't, you know, kill someone for attempted murder, I suppose. Um, she's kept away from her sister's court. She'll only be a threat. You're going to forgive her? He's not happy. I mean, in, in engendering her, not pardoning her, she will serve as a heavy labour in Northern Ursul. She should be made an example of! She will be put down in the squatted... Yeah, she should, should be drawn and squatted in the public square. I have spoken! I have said, I have said what I was going to say! God bless you, miss! What, for putting you to hard labour? Oh dear. Oh! We can go and get the crystal! Pride of what passed through his regards. Oh, presence failed. Well, you know, despite eyelash fluttering, foot stomping and outright threats, they won't budge. So, there we go. Was that presence or something? Oh, we haven't got nothing in here at all. No elegance, no a little bit of composure. Okay, maybe we should start looking at other stuff then. I mean, um, look at trade and presence. That's what elegance actually. Let's do elegance. I'm gonna be elegant. So let's be elegant and trade. Done. Sorted. Yeah, I didn't do that. 
the thing I was... You are too lonely to focus properly on the subject. Ah, oh, yeah, that's fine. You learn that even the smallest villages are a central market where locals can trade and they uh, have grown... What they have grown or made others who have different skills. You hear a strange sound, look up to the owl flying overhead. A single dry leaf flutters in its talons. Oh, test! Falcon! Success! Marvellous! An owl flying in the open... That's unusual. I wonder if something attacked it. You return to castle, your father is waiting for you. Well, there's a woman here to see you. She wishes crown funding for her progress. Oh, I'll probably just reject it because I don't know what the bloody hell it is. I have come to behalf of the people. I wish to build a hospital um, where any city inflicted with disease can be brought for treatment. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Bloody hell. Centralizing resources can help people who don't have doctors of their own. I shall invest in that. Let's build, let's get the NHS going. We're happy to invest in your venture. Great. So what I think I will do now is... Hmm. I might actually, because we... <laughs> it's only like week 14 or something. There's obviously 56 weeks in this. I've been going for almost an hour. And I might just stop playing for now. So, um, I tell you, we'll do one more week and see if we can get some sort of like intrigue happening. What I'll do is, in the comments, for those of you who made it so far, I will ask if you want me to continue this. And if you want me to, if enough people want me to, I will, and I'll record this and upload it on Sundays until it's done and we see it through to its final conclusion, whether it be me, you know, being assassinated or making a complete hammer things, or, you know, leading the world into great marvellousness. Um, but we'll do one more week, and then... Um, I'll stop for this Halloween special. So, uh, yeah, let me know if you want to see more of this and maybe we'll get this finished because uh, it's obviously worth playing. So for, uh, we'll, we'll visit the, um, let's look at mood again. So we want to be a little more pressured to get lonely out. So I'm going to do this again. So yielding, depressed and pressured, that's fine. So if we look at our mood, we see that we're quite... We're quite depressed and quite yielding now, but a little less, a little less lonely and not very angry or afraid, which is great. So, uh, for our last week, um, what I think we should probably do is, uh, should we, should we do, um, hmm, I'm thinking about look, investing into military here, because I think that, we're, that towards the end of the game we might start, um, you know, getting into fights and stuff. Okay, let's, let's go with dogs again, and probably hmm, herbs, just cause. So we'll go with herbs, and we'll go with uh, and the, the, the doggies. So, in week 15, sage is a variety of health benefits, it keeps meat from spoiling, aids her digestion, improves thinking, may even be help to bring Call about to grey hair. And at noon, you learn about dog grooming and the most common diseases you inflict the dogs suffer from. You learn the standing commands and working with trained hunting dogs and retrievers. Okay, sweet. And the last event is remember that the Festival of Good Lady is approaching. Ah, the Festival of Good Lady! So if you want to hook to continue this series, the Festival of the Good Lady is there. There will be public celebrations for the commoners, followed by a grand gala for the nobility. As queen, you'll be expected to lead the procession and take part in the ceremonial planting. Possibly give a speech. However, since you are not yet crowned, it is not required and may not make it uh, safe to expose you to the public. What do you mean, not safe? Outside the castle, you are less well protected. If anyone means you harm, think of it now. Decide later. Dun, dun, dun! This is a letter for you as well. It's from Bryony. Uh, I went to school with her. But she is a couple of years older than me. Her mother is a Duchess of Mead. Oh, Mead! Oh, no. I lie with them. She's complaining that her mother still won't let her come home for the holidays. Apparently her uncle, uh, Kevin, is actually furious about that woman's trial. Oh, that. Mm. She's bored and looking for adventure. Well, I don't have anything to suggest her. Right, so we'll leave it at that. So, this thing of the good lady is coming up. And we may have to make a speech and possibly face some sort of plot. Our assassination attempt. So if you do want to see some more of this, let me know in the comments. Regardless, I hope that you have enjoyed this Halloween scary special. And uh, you have a good one. Um, 
and uh, and I will see you for, for some more videos sometime later. Thank you very much for watching this scary, scary, scary video of death. And I'll see you some other time. Cheers very much for watching. And toodling.